Hello, hello, hello there. Each hold on. My name is Bailey Robert Chandler. I'm outside this bin store. You. And I'm out. Well, actually, I am in Morantown, which is awesome that I didn't get. Well, it's awesome that I'm not staying in the hospital overnight. That's good. That's the good news. The bad news, well, this is also the good news. We found out, yeah, we found out what happened with the sore. Well, let me tell you something. Don't get infected. <laughs> um, also, as for my heart, it's at 38% uh, function. Which, yeah, if that doesn't sound good, but if you think about it. It's still in the same spot where it was, I think. Of course, I'm out of the hospital. Now we're going into this bin store. It says no food or drink, which is sad. Well, okay. Let's look in here. Hi. Oh, okay. Now, if you see here, yeah, we're going to find out some stuff real quick. Like, um, like, um, how much are the days? Of course, it's Monday, which you know what that means. Uh, it means Monday Night Raw, but it also means $4 day. Apparently, it is Monday, right? <laughs> yeah, it's Monday. <laughs> I keep forgetting my days. Yeah, it's Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Yeah, there we go. And not the other way around. Not Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. It's Monday, Tuesday. Okay, it's the other way, or at least count forward it is, you know. That's how you do it. No, it's not my birthday. My birthday was a month ago. Thank you very much. I wish it was my birthday, but it's not. That was a month ago. <laughs> And let me tell you something about Morgantown. It's nice. Better than Charleston. Better than Huntington. Yeah, also, if John Cena retires, which he is, you know, it's going to be sad when he retires. You know, unless if you don't like John Cena, which I know some of you don't. But guess what? John Cena is a good person. And um, I'm trying to think here. If, what? Yeah. Yeah, John Cena is a nice person. That's why, yeah. Just remember that. John Cena is also a phenomenal actor, too. Hmm. What's this? Oh. Trying to think. That's not well. Actually, hold on. If you turn it this way, it um, doesn't look good. That doesn't look good. That, that looks like a Pokemon drawing. Now, um. I can tell you a lot of things about Morantown. Yeah, but I want to tell you stuff about John Cena. See, John Cena's been doing wrestling for for um, years. I mean, I first saw John Cena 
in 2009, and I wondered, who's this guy? And it turns out he actually is a nice guy, except for when he was feuding with The Rock, which is Dwayne Johnson, as you all know, or Dwayne The Rock Johnson. I think that's the only time he got severely booed at the most. Or at ECW One Night Stand, which sounds like a weird pay per view. <laughs> and also, per se, John Cena is a nice guy, and if, if per se, John Cena was a nice guy, I would be telling you that, but he is a nice guy. I can tell you that. I've seen John Cena live in person, which is awesome. You got John Cena. You told him, and let me. So I don't bother anyone. Now, as you may know, John Cena, I thank you, even though some of you may not like him. That's okay, we had different opinions all the time. Unless if you're Shane Storm, then you shouldn't have opinions at all. You should be in jail more. See, if you're a criminal, you shouldn't have an opinion because you're a criminal. Especially a high-profile criminal that um, cyber-bullied me when I was 17 years old and he was 40-something. You know, that should be on the lines of getting in trouble as bad as a pedo, a.k.a. a pedophile. Sure, that's not a pedophile, but he should be in trouble like one. And he should be drowned in the pool. But other than that, but besides having opinions on John Cena, if you got to think about it, John Cena has been there, if I had to count, he's been there about as long as Randy Orton. And Randy Orton's a good heel. He's a good person. I meant a good person in some people's eyes. I meant, yeah, there's controversy of Randy Orton. But I'm like, Dad, John Cena, he's a good actor. He's a good, he was a good host on Saturday Night he was, a, he was a good host on Saturday Night Live back when I watched it, back in 2016, which was a bad time at the time because, well, you know, to me it seemed bad, but it was funny to see he on what SNL that Saturday Night Live, and that was awesome right there. He was so funny. I mean... When he played a jock at a college, he made the best of it. He, he made most of the jocks probably mad, but, but you know, at least he got an A plus from from his report on bananas. You know, that that was funny. And oranges, you know. I think mostly bananas. And I laughed so hard. And he said, "A uh, uh, banana is a yellow snack that monkey eats." That monkeys eat or something like that. Some of them are yellow, some of them are brown, and some of them are round. And they were talking about the orange, but you see, they wanted to pass him because he went on the football team. You see, well, and it was funny. And then when they showed him, and then when they showed him that peanut butter jelly kind of banana dancing, he said, "Peanut butter jelly cup, peanut." Butter. It was funny. Like, that's the best way when I see our John Cena outside of wrestling. The worst moment of probably his life was getting defeated by Dwayne the Rock Johnson, which is sad, but but then again he got his revenge later. I think he got because it was that the year after they had twice in a lifetime instead of once in a lifetime then became twice. You know, and then years and years down the road I think we almost got twice, which is three times. 
you know, like time, which is now getting redundant, you know, the light time. Once in a lifetime. No, it's twice in a lifetime. In a lifetime, you know. More in town, it's awesome. When you don't have to stay in the hospital, it's awesome. That's a good thing, people. Hey, look, a pay phone. Let's see if it works. Hello? Hello? Um, is this Shane Storm? Is your refrigerator running? Well, you better go catch it. Because guess what? It'd be the last refrigerator you ever buy. And he's not gonna know it because that payphone doesn't really work in the first place. It doesn't work at all. I, I heard it, I didn't hear a beep. I didn't hear that beep, but anyway, let's call somebody else. Hello, is your refrigerator running? Yeah, well, you better go catch it because guess what? I'm gonna bloody you up. Actually, I take that back. I'm going to do way worse things than buddy you up. Sure, that's not a joke, but still. i tell you what the joke is. Hello, will you remember me in a year? Yes. Okay. Will you remember me in a month or so? Sort of. Knock, knock. Who's there? See, you already forgot about me, so guess what? You're dumb and retarded. I'm having fun with that pay fine. Probably, probably shouldn't be putting it up to my ear because it's full of dust. But you know what? This pay fine would have been good for causing chaos if, if it worked. I mean, sure, they couldn't trace my actual phone, my cell phone, that I'm. Yeah, if only pay phones still work, I could threaten people, and they wouldn't be able to find me but this pay phone. You see what I'm saying? Oh, hello, um, Junior. How you doing? It's been a, w a while. Um, d d just remember, the pay phones don't work anymore, and don't threaten people even over a pay phone, even though... It doesn't really work in the first place, so, and I may have just, but the pay phone doesn't work anyway. I heard it, and it didn't do what it did, so. How are you doing? Uh, well, i tell you how I'm doing. I got this big sore on my arm, but also, I heard that I'm doing fine right now. We're, we're in Morgantown, or at least I am in Morgantown. I'll show you what restaurant I want, and it looks like it is open because I saw someone go in. Sure, I may not be able to film the restaurant, but here, I'm going to show you a restaurant that's good, but even though it's in Morgantown, and I know you guys say in the Charleston area, but I'm going to show you anyway, whoever's watching. Yeah, the Boston Beanery. Yeah! Just pretending you didn't hear me call someone the R word, you know, over a knock knock joke that they forgot about me. Even see, I see, I fooled that person, even though I had to act like that person. Anyway, I'm Bailey Robert Chandler signing off. I hope you have a good day, and um. Keep calm and be like me because I'm Bailey Robert Chandler and I'm, wait for it.